So we're gonna start with, this is what we use for hand grip. What you're gonna wanna do is start by obviously turning it on and then you're gonna wanna press test until it selects to LR. Then you're gonna wanna hit number of trials until it goes to three. So you can see LR three. Then we're gonna have our participant and she's gonna be sitting on the bed, feet on the floor, just whatever is really comfortable. And you're gonna make sure to keep this, like the results blinded from the subject. So we're gonna start, you're gonna wanna press test. So we got a notch. Oh yeah, so that it's L1. So that's what we're gonna start on. And then you also wanna make sure before starting the test that it's a comfortable notch level for the participant. So does that feel? Yep. Okay. Good. Sweet. And then you can move it by just sliding this out and moving it forward or backwards. So what we're gonna do is run over the protocol with them. You'll have your SOP and you're just gonna wanna read this out loud to the participants so they're both on the same page. So what we're gonna do is starting with your arms flexed, we're gonna have them excrete the most pressure that they can for five seconds, and then we're gonna have them break for another 30 seconds. So we'll start this right now. We'll do one trial for both left and right hand. So with your little timer, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna count down and then she's gonna exert that maximum force. So go ahead in three, two, one. We want to get this going for five seconds and relax. And now you'll want to go ahead and so that the time says 35, so that you're giving them that sample 30 seconds. Switching to the left, and then again press that test button so that it is right one down. So we got about 15 more seconds, and then she's going to be doing her the right hand. So we'll start you in five. Four, three, two, and one. And relax. So you'll just wanna keep doing this for the next like two sets of trials. So you have three trials total, each time remembering to press the test button. And then at the end, if you press test one more time after the last right three, it'll show you an average for both your left and right hand. And you'll wanna write that down as well. And that's it for hand grip.